Hi there. Do you cry often? Do you cry behind closed doors? Do you cry sometimes in the shower and you want nobody to know that you're crying? And sometimes you cry but you do not know the reason why you're crying. Why these tears are trickling down your cheeks? You have no clue, no idea because your life is perfect. Whereas other times you know the reason why you're crying. You can exactly tap on the reason that this is the reason why I'm crying. And when you cry in front of your family members, they all tell you that you're a cry baby and you're a weak person because you're not able to take life head on. You're scared to cry in public because you'll be considered a coward. Crying is not a sign of weakness, it's a sign of strength. The person who's crying might not know the reason or might know the reason why he or she is crying. But the person who cries has a very good relationship with himself or herself. They know how to give a release to their feelings and emotions in the right way. In fact, if you are not able to cry, you are keeping your emotions and feelings all locked and pent up inside and they do not have a way out of your system. Whereas while crying, you are just releasing your hidden feelings and emotions. And that's a beautiful way of letting them all out of your system. However, you also have to understand how much is too much. If the crying is happening too often and uncontrollably, there could be other reasons underlying. But at the same time, if you're crying for some small reasons and it's okay and you feel just right after crying, remember that these tears are acting like catharsis. And it's making you fresh, rejuvenated and relaxed. So don't feel guilty if you're not crying too often, but you're crying sometimes. Good day.